Hey there, welcome to this walkthrough of the Kanban board Google Sheet designed by plrdoc.com. If you're looking for a simple yet powerful way to manage your projects, track progress, and keep your work workflow efficient, then you're in the right place. A Kanban board is an agile project management tool that helps you visualize work, limit work in progress, and maximize efficiency. With this Google Sheet, you'll be able to organize tasks seamlessly, monitor progress in real time, and ensure nothing slips through the cracks. In this video, I will walk you through how to use this sheet effectively, customize it to fit your needs, and get the most out of this productivity tool. Let's dive in. So uh, the first thing is that you have here an instructions tab. Make sure that you read it carefully before you start using this sheet. It has all the information that you'll need. Uh, secondly, there is the tasks tab here, and as simple as you just list down the tasks here that you need, uh, that you have, and there is a little box here, here you are going to list down the statuses, the statuses you list here, I listed for example, not started pending, in progress, cancelled and completed, if you, the, 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 the statuses that you list here will appear in the drop down list here as you use the, the table, and the priorities here, I listed high, medium, low, and these statuses will appear here in the priority. So, for example, if I add here uh, uh, a status that is, let's say, um, not important status, it will appear here in the drop down list in the statuses not important. And same for the priority thing, if I add uh, medium, for example, high there is another priority which is medium high it will appear here in the drop down list so this is how you do the setup and let's just go and add some dates here let's say that we have something for the 1st of february a task for the 1st of february here and the status and the, the task is let's say uh, hire new salesman and I want him in the, uh, let's say this business has the retail and uh, and the corporate side. I'm going to add here retail and I'm going to, I also I want to add February uh, 2. I want to add higher uh, sales, uh, sales manager here and I want him for retail okay and let's say that uh, by the 15th of February I need to hire a corporate sales rep and I want to say corporate here uh, let's say I need him at least 10 years experience in the subtext here and I'm listing down things uh, I'll say that on the 25th of February 25th February 2025 I want to 25 February 2025 I want to add <coughs> uh, let's say check inventory and um, I will say uh, check uh, production uh, performance or let's say check quality in stock while checking the inventory I'm just adding here some tasks and let's that would be enough let's say this status is uh, a completed task this one is an in-progress task this one is a 
let's say um, completed one and this one is not started okay and this one is high this one is high this one is medium this one is low okay now i listed the tasks and i prioritized them and I set a status for each one this is how you fill this table now go to the Kanban board here you will find this board and these uh, titles you will just open the drop down list and i want to see all the tasks that are not started here and it will here will automatically the the task that i have uh, set check the inventory check the quality uh, in stock it will appear here automatically so i'm going to also to choose here the completed task and all the completed tasks will appear here i'll say i'll uh, choose the in progress i have the hire a sales manager in progress and cancelled i don't have anything that is cancelled and um, pending i don't have any tasks that are pending so if i choose if i change this for example to pending it will give me the things that are pending if i change it to not started here the the, the, the tasks that are not started will be listed here but I want to see it as completed, okay? And as I change the statuses here in the tasks tab, for example, I'm going to change this to, uh, let's say, pending, okay? If I go back to the Kanban board, I will find it uh, updated automatically to the pending section. So I'll get everything here listed <clears throat> below each other so that I can uh, view it and uh, monitor the progress easily from this tab. Finally, there is the calendar tab. And in the calendar here, I choose when does my uh, week start. Sometimes it's on Monday, sometimes it's on Sunday. So let's say here, I my week starts on, on Monday and I want to see February's schedule. And I select the year and it automatically tells me that uh, the first day of the month, which is the first of uh, February, of course, now you will find here a very interesting uh, uh graph here tells me how many uh, how many tasks are on a medium uh, priority high low and uh, for the whole for in the 25th so in the first i have one high and the second i have one medium 15th i have one low and one high in uh, the 25th of february uh, these are the total number of activities that I have. I have four, as I listed there, C, one, two, three, four. And it tells me that uh, the high priority activities are two, one in the 1st of February, one of the 20, on the 25th. And a very uh, clean and informative view for the calendar here for everything that I, that uh, every task, when it will start and, uh, and here they are listed under each date. So on Saturday, the higher salesman and so on in a very clean and informative way. Also, these will list down all the tasks that I have in February for in the year 2025. And um, there is a pie chart here that is giving me uh, how many tasks I have in February of in the total month in, as of high and low and uh, medium. Okay, and that wraps up our walkthrough of the plrdoc.com Kanban board uh, Google Sheet. I hope this video helped you understand how to use this tool to manage your projects more, effect more efficiently and effectively. With this sheet, you can stay on top of your tasks, visualize progress, and improve workflow like never before. If you have any questions or need further customization, feel free to reach out. Thanks for watching and happy organizing.